Welcome back, everybody! On this exciting episode of Dragon Ball Z, we're gonna go talk to a lot of people. No, I'm just kidding. It's not Dragon Ball Z, obviously. Oh my gosh, but seriously, though. I just got this map called Commandia. And we're probably gonna be doing that at some point. I don't know if it's gonna be today. I don't know if it's gonna be tomorrow. I don't know if it's gonna be two days from now, but we're going to do it. Why do I say a day or two from now? You might be wondering when I literally have it right there. Well, because we're gonna be doing something else right now. So we were supposed to be going to a place called Sadie Town after we beat the Bazo Forest. And you're going to see why very, very soon. Well, it might actually be a little bit, but you'll see. You'll see. I promise you it'll be wonderful. We're gonna move to the tavern because there's gonna be someone here that apparently we have to talk to, I guess. I don't know why, but we just have to. I don't remember who it was. Was it someone? Some things can be forgotten, even over time. Okay, you're not the one I'm talking to. Instead of boring peace, I prefer this war. It's so much easier to experience a dramatic romance now. Okay, you're not the one. Uh, some people fought for more people's wars. If they use money to better their country, there must be heroes there. Okay, not you either. In times of trouble, we get more of that kind, and Loon is the third I've seen personally acting that way. I am the rebirth of Saint Nervoth. I am... I said... Okay. I saw this huge silver bird fly up the river. Nobody believes me, but I saw it with my very own two eyes. You believe that I'm not lying to you, right? What? Oh. Okay, now she's mentioning them. I, I talked to her before, and she was like, didn't mention anything. I was like, one of these people are supposed to mention something about a guy named Daniel, apparently. Okay, so this is the one. My boyfriend Daniel left two years ago. He was going to make a name for himself in the city. Well, where is he? You people travel widely. And please, I want you to look for Daniel. Of course, I will pay you for your trouble, whatever it takes. Okay. So that starts some kind of weird stuff where I'm apparently supposed to do something crazy, like a fetch quest sort of thing. So this could be a little boring, but I'm going to end up doing this anyway just because I want to do it. I don't know why, I just do. It's all there is to it. I just want to do it. Oh, oh, before I go on with that little fetch quest, though... I want to show you something I got off screen. I got a couple things, in fact. Speaking of a couple things, I kind of want to get rid of that. Wait a second. Did the... Why does she have map 13 equipped? Why in the world does she have map 13 equipped? Does the plug get used up permanently whenever I do that? That's kind of weird. I don't understand, but sure. Let's see, where was it again? You're right there. I don't know why she just automatically got equipped with that. But yeah, map 13. A map... What? Okay, that makes even less sense. Where's the one I just got? That one. A map showing the way to command you the last fortress. Why is it the last fortress? I have no idea. Why can't it be... The middle fortress? I mean, certainly there's gonna be some more fortresses being built at some point, you know? Yeah, I still got the plug. I don't... I don't get it. That's weird. They just automatically got equipped for no reason. Anyway, though, I got Map B, which is kind of pointless, but hey, you know what? It was there. I might as well get it. There's no point to having it, apparently. But, eh. I ended up getting a lump! From the grime emerged the end prism, the crystal of new stars. And it's a red one. It's very nice. It's almost like the orange one, but it's round. Kind of, you know? And I also got... Well, I got the prism, I got the map, and I got another map. So yeah, okay, that was basically it then in that case. But of course I want to equip it with something, so let's not be stupid about that. Because, I mean, who wants to be stupid about things, right? I don't. I sure as heck don't. I don't know what I want to give her right now. Do I want to give her a cape? I think I'll give her a cape. Yeah, why not? Wait, I got one of these in storage? No, I'll give her that one, though. I want to give someone else the W cape. Or the S cape, I should say. I think maybe I would lean towards Pertow since he's already got a W cape on? Yeah, probably. I'll give it to you, man. I will absolutely give it to you. There you go, you can have even more dexterity. It'll be wonderful. It'll be so, so wonderful. How many W cape? Oh, I probably have too many of them, it doesn't matter. So how many do I have of those anyway? I have no idea. Alright, so basically, like I said, 
or I think I said, oh, by the way, today's poll day, just an FYI, if you didn't realize that already. But yeah, anyway, going on about that, look for, the, look for a link in the description. There should be a link, I think, at the end of the video, if I don't forget. It should be in the description and the end of the video, so just keep an eye for that. Should be an end screen, I think. Either an end screen or a card. Just just look out for one of those two. I don't know which one it'll be. It'll be one of those two, though. Anyway, I need to go to town, so... I'm gonna go to Apos Village. Supposedly, what you're supposed to do when that girl asks for Daniel, it's like, oh, you're supposed to go to every single town in the entire game, go to all the taverns. I don't know if I'm supposed to talk to these people, but I'm gonna talk to them just to be on the safe side. Kind of bad. Okay, so I probably won't read these just because uh, it's probably going to be a little bit long. Fortnite of deprivation and prayer was required of all believers. I might quickly read these. I want to make a pilgrimage to the Holy Nirvana. I heard that on... I don't think I've ever read these, actually. I heard that the Nigran Cathedral is a magnificent symbol of our religion. Hi, Daniel. Oh, sorry, but you look so much like him. He's very generous. How about you? Can to buy me a drink? Nah, I'll pass. There was a grand city between Natra and Vernage. It's gone now, though. I think it was called Cyclops. Who calls their city Cyclops? It's a dumb name for a town. I don't think about it. Have I been in this city at all? Hold on. Shopkeeper, do I know you? Have I seen you before? I think I have seen him before. Ah, oh, well. Anyway, it's enough of that. We don't. This guy's not important. He's not important at all. What is important is getting to the next village. We're gonna depart, and we're gonna see what awaits us in the next location. Oh, who? Who's gonna know Daniel in the next location? I don't know. I honestly don't know. So we've got five cities to check out. Oh boy. Sounds like fun. Sounds like a lot of fun. All right, we'll go over there. Nazca City should be fine, I would think. Woo! Excuse me. Oh man, Nazca, Nazca, Nazca. What do you, what do you got for us? I'm here and ready to go and get you big time. Let's see. Talk to you. The civil war is dragging on because it can. Not well before, so it's possible to keep the war after going. It's ironic we can race like to fight a war longer. I didn't mean to do that. Don't appear to be in a relationship. If you want to take the initiative, you should feign indifference. Hmm? What if no one talks to you at all? How should I know? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I heard Pope Pure finally passed away. They say that when the Pope's throne is vacant, that should often occur. It's a bad omen. The distant land of Zero is a legendary place. It is cursed with bloodshed as a, the origin and the end of all things. That's what the legends claim. It's supposed to be far across the sea. What, you've eaten your other self? That's astounding. Well, that's... That's zero you're talking about, though. What? Beating my other self is the mirror room. That's in the same location, but not exactly the same. But this is just the beginning. You can meet your other again, but stronger. Or at least that's what the, the legends say. I'm not sure if it's true or not. Oh, it's true. It's true. Daniel, you're looking for that wastrel. Wastrel? I get it. He must have borrowed money from you too, didn't he? I don't know, and I don't care where he could be. Well, sadly, I have to care where he's at because I have to find him. I literally have to find him. Wherever the heck he is, he is somewhere. <laughs> where is he, though? Oh my gosh. Oh, jeez. Yuger! I want to engage in battle. No, I'm just gonna enter the town. Let's do it that way. Because it makes a little more sense. Move to the tavern. Tavern, what do you got for me? Hey, Daniel. How about setting, settling up your tab? You owe us 5,000 gold. You're not leaving until you clear that up. What? You say you're Kratos and not Daniel? I swear you look the same as him. So you're Kratos and Daniel's one who o who owes us money? You're not pulling a fast one, are you? Well, sorry. Have a drink on us. 
It'd be funny if we actually were Daniel and it's like, well, okay then. We looks like we just ripped this guy off. Men won't look you in the eyes when you're lying, but if a woman is looking you too intently at your eyes, she's lying most likely. See, you just learned from an old pro. I'm in shock. The lovely Rosalie quit working at the adults only pub. Oh, woe is me. The rock is an advanced irrigation canal. It's been abandoned since it cost so much to run. There's nothing there now. King Randall's a symbol of the kingdom's power. His massive bell echoed to the far-flung corners of the kingdom. People in the past could create and talk to stars. Gemini is a sacred place where people converse with the heavens. Oh, did they now? Did they? Well... Okay then. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was a delicious yawn. I'm yawning a lot right now. And I don't know what to think about that. Alright, Luxar Village. Let's do this. You're the next location on my list to go to. And by list, I mean I don't actually have a list. I'm just supposed to go visit literally every town in the entire game, which is great. And then obviously this location was not visited yet, so therefore it's on my imaginary list that doesn't really exist. Daniel is an excellent worker. He always keeps himself busy, says he's going to make a name for himself. Okay, this guy's got like the opposite opinion of the other people, but alrighty then. Foreign Ants Republic is really a dictatorship. The important positions in the government are filled by the rich Witzel clan. The Witzel clan, huh? Whoever becomes king, it doesn't matter to me. I'm happy so long as I don't have to worry about food. And you know what I like to eat? Lots and lots of tea and soup. <laughs> Poverty's bad, but being royal must be tough. Like everything else, neither too little or too much is best. True, true. If you can be in the middle, you're doing pretty well for yourself. They used to hold executions in the mountains. I think the place is still there. It was called Jack something. Yeah, Jack Blade. The shopkeeper supposedly knows a secret passage. He won't tell us where though. He just laughs and clams up about it. Dang it. Always clamming up about things. Maybe he should stop doing that. Maybe he should not clam up about everything he goes around and does. He does it. He does it, you know. He freaking does it. <laughs> Oh, man. Alright, no, 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 no. I'm gonna go save that one for last. Because reasons. I'm so glad I don't automatically go into that location. That would suck, because, I mean, geez, I haven't done that battle yet. So it's like, oh, okay, what if I just go over it randomly? Okay, anyway, I'm gonna move to the tavern, of course. Where else am I gonna move? I'm gonna move everywhere, of course. My relatives in Domingo Village stopped writing. It's not like them to respond. It's not like them to not respond. Maybe something's wrong. Yeah, you'd be correct. Fernance has a ver veneer of, oh, so cultured civility. But most of their wealth comes from exploiting slaves from colonies. They say there are people who look totally alike. Well, it must be true. I mistook you for Daniel completely. Your name's Kratos, Daniel isn't here. Have you heard about Commandia? Yes, I've seen it on the map, in fact. It's a fortress that is difficult to attack for even airborne units. Great. It sounds wonderful. Some fool pulled the drain plug from Kolaba Swamp. He needs to be taught a painful lesson. Well, don't teach me a painful lesson. Because otherwise I'm going to defend myself, and I mean, who wants to do that? <sighs> Excuse me, I don't want to defend myself from old people. Heck no, just heck no. Alright, Kiss Kana. You're the last place in the list, and then I gotta go somewhere else. You'll see, you'll see very soon. Move to the tavern! I want to move to the tavern. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's see. A young local guy joined the cooter cult. He donated all his belongings, everything, but he seemed to be quite happy. He's happy about it. He must be okay, I guess. Wars and the exchange of culture go hand in hand. 
The winners and losers end up sharing the cultures and customs. Of course, there must have been civilizations that were entirely wiped out. People are really worried about Rainbow. No one knows what it is, or who made it, or why. Do you know? No, not at all, but I killed all the people building it, and yet they kept building it despite me killing them all somehow. Daniel? Oh, you're looking for Daniel. You just missed him. He went out to some new job he found. Shut up! I used to be somebody! <laughs> Okay. Oh, okay. Who cares? Different classes. <laughs> Eleni, I always I. <laughs> if you want to take it that far, <laughs> dang! All that money spent, but no one cares. I'm blowing my last chance to return to the research institute. If only this worked, even the Twin Empire would fear me. Professor, is it really you, Professor Darius? Professor, this drunken old coot is that is important? Yes, indeed. Professor Darius is highly regarded. He was a top scientist at the Natural Royal Research Institute. Unfortunately, wine and women led to his expulsion from the institute. I recall a rather indelicate incident with a certain lady of royal repute. And for that... But you quit talking as if I wasn't here! Do you believe all that rubbish? You make me ill. I... I'm sorry, Professor. I meant you no disrespect. Ah, whatever. It's true for the most part. Er, uh, indeed. Have you been ca continuing your research since your expulsion, Professor? Naturally! I developed a revolutionary weapon. It can instantly eliminate countries. But so far, nobody's buying. Instantly eliminate entire countries? You're interested? Very well, I'll show you. Travel the Porter River, I will be waiting for you. I will recall there being an island on Porter River. Oh, wait a second now. Up the Porter River? Well, wait a second, I was told to talk to an old man, but that was a middle-aged man. I don't get it. So up the Porter River... Yeah, there it is, Octopus. Okay, well... Anyway, we got the location Octopus, we got the location Commandia, and now we're about to get another location. We're going back to Sadie Town, Sadie Town, whatever you want to call it. We're going over there to go find Daniel again. Yes, it goes all full circle in the end. You go to every single village and you go back to Sadie Town, and then BOOM! Just like that. You come back here. Uh, some other people from, uh, okay. Uh, hi, Daniel, what's up? He really does look like me. That's weird. I've decided to return to my girl back home. I've realized now that people in love should stick together. Thank you. I didn't do anything, but okay. Oh yes, I found this map while traveling. You might find it useful. Pardon? The bar tab at Mizor Village? It wasn't me. Or was it? Okay, well, thank you, Daniel. I appreciate the map that you gave me. <coughs> Excuse me. So now that we've got that, we can finally initiate our goals in this episode today. Or one of them, I should say. I don't know. Which one are we doing? Where is it even at? He gave us a map, but I don't know where it's at. Is that you? It is you. Okay. So we can do one of three maps. We can do Gemini, we can do Octopus, or we can do Commandia. I suppose... I suppose we could use a random number generator for that. Give me a second, everyone. I'm going to pull out my phone right this very moment in time. And I'm going to do some crazy stuff here. Let's see. Random.org, please come on up, please. All right. So number one is going to be Kamenia. Number two is going to be Octopus. And number three is going to be Triangle. No, I'm just kidding. It's going to be... Where did it go? There it is. Gemini. So basically the order in which we got them. So, let's see. Insert that. Alright, random.org decided number one. So we're going to do Commandia then in that case. But before I do that, obviously I'm going to save. Because, you know, it would be a good idea to save. So that way we don't have to redo all of that stuff we just did. For some reason this map ends up being too difficult, which it shouldn't be, but you never know. 
Or not even too difficult. Maybe I just can't access something for some weird reason. I don't know. You never know. I do have the coordinates, actually, for all three of these maps that I just unlocked for key items that need to be gotten. Or, well, maybe not key items necessarily, but just items that, of interest. They aren't necessarily items of importance, but they are items of interest, at the very least. So, yeah. I got the coordinates written down for all that stuff, so hopefully they are accessible. If they're not accessible, then what the freaking heck? So, for this map, I don't know if this had any marks on it, but... The two, there are two items of interest here, and they both come from treasure chest. Wait a second. I'm looking at the wrong one. No, 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 no. Okay, these are two marks then in that case. Or are they? I don't know. There's two items of interest, though, and I don't know if they're both from... Oh my gosh, not this thing again. Okay. Defeat all enemies, death of hero. Yay! But anyway, though, as I was saying, though, there's two items of interest. I think they might be in chest. Is this one of my coordinates? This is Commandia, so no, this is actually not one of my item, item coordinates. But I might still go after this because I don't remember if I wrote down everything I needed or not. I might just go after it anyway. I don't know. I don't remember. I forgot. Oh, gosh. This is why they're saying it's going to be hard for even people with flying armor to traverse. That's dumb. I, I don't like maps like this. I do not like them. It's nice to put blocks, though, I guess. Oh, man. Okay. Let's get our formation ready to go, I say. Let's see. I would like you to be over there. You can go over there. And you can go over there. That should be good. Yeah, yeah, alright. This is exactly the formation I would like to see right now. Actually, no, I'd like to have you right there. No, 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 no. Vlad, you can go over there. There we go. I think that is a setup I can go with right now. Alright. Are you ready? Let us begin! Battle start! All right, now let's look at the whole map in entirety here. So, there is literally just the one chest. So the coordinates I wrote down were for two marks. Sometimes I just don't really remember what I did. Because sometimes I might not write down coordinates if the if the chest is a chest. Or the item is a chest, I should say. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. I should be a little bit more consistent and actually do it consistently. But, I don't know if I did or not this time, so I'm probably going to end up getting the chest anyway. Anyway, there's two marks. Can you spot them? Because honestly, right now... Right now, I can't say I can really spot them. So... Wait. I think I spotted one, actually. Right there? Well, according to my notes, that is indeed a mark. So it looks like that is one. So I didn't see a second one, but okay, the coordinates for that one are Oh. It's underneath this guy's feet. That's why that was hard to spot. I can actually see a little bit of something there. So I can see why that was hard to spot anyway. That's fine, that's fine. Alright, Vlad. It is time for you to do your thing. You're going to get eleven people fruited up. Fruit everyone! Just fruit them all! It'll be wonderful. They'll taste the deliciousness of fruit. They'll be like, Mmm, fruit! I feel rejuvenated now! Oh, that's awesome! Alright, and... I'm just gonna wait. I guess I'll be doing a lot of waiting while these guys come closer. Come on, come closer, you know you want to. Or do you? I don't know if these maps were really that important, but they had items of interest at the very least. Not necessarily important items, but just items of interest, which is still something I would want. Oh, man. What are we going to do about this? What in the world are we going to do about this? I honestly have no clue. Yeah, fly up all you want. See if I care. You can fly 
all day, every day, and it still won't make a difference. Da 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 Freaking goodness sakes, my gosh. Alright. Last exhortation. I'm just gonna keep calling it exhortation because what the heck, I don't know. Old habits die hard, as they always say, so therefore, just call it exhortation all the time. Even if it's wrong, just do it. Just freaking do it. Alright, so that's that. Well, I guess I'm just going to let them keep approaching, I suppose. Alright, alright. And once they are done approaching, everything will be fine, I suppose. That'll be good. I don't mind that. As long as the archers aren't going to shoot me. I don't want archers shooting me. Archers shooting me would be kind of bad. Oh my gosh! This is great! Can't believe this is actually happening right now. Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 oh. Better watch out, you people. You're gonna die to the power of my brawlers and my evil dolls and my everything. Everything's gonna destroy you. Also, the lance. The lance of fire is going to absolutely just annihilate you. You're gonna be like, what just happened? Did I really just get annihilated just now? What the heck is going on here? Okay, so you can't attack. Can anyone attack right now? The answer is a no. Wait, come to think of it, you, what do you got? Oh, you got a black hole, do you? Okay, that's neat. It's pretty cool that you got a black hole, but I don't really care about your black hole. I All I care about is what this guy's got now. You've got Aqua Freeze and also a black hole. Okay, then. It was all heat from the ground and air to create a world of ice. Now that sounds pretty cool. No pun intended. <laughs> Or did I intend upon? Wait, oh no! Multiple mages? Oh, this is gonna be bad, come to think of it. Well, wait, no, it's, that's not true. Because that's the thing, I could basically just get hit, heal, get hit, heal. It won't be that bad. It'll be fine. Alright, I end my turn. I think we'll be okay in the end. It'll be just fine. As long as people don't die, I literally don't care. It's all good in the end. It's all good in the end. And that archer's not gonna be powerful enough to kill anyone, so eh. whoop de do, I suppose. whoop de do. These guys can hit literally everyone they want to hit, but it's all right. We're gonna get a lot of level ups out of this. And when you get a lot of level ups, you did it pretty well. Thinking now. I'm still thinking now. I'm always thinking now. You better think some more before it's too late. Oh yeah, I love thinking. Ugh. Think some more, dang it, think some more. All right, congratulations on thinking successfully. It's really nice you do that. But anyway, what we need to do now is we need to do that. Start baiting them in for their magical attacks. Aw, he wasn't able to get everyone. That's too bad. That's okay, though. That's okay. I don't mind. Next turn, they'll be able to get everyone, though. 70, 70, 70, 70. Wow, that was pointless. I was expecting true power. But that wasn't quite what I was expecting at all now, was it? Nope. Okay, you're injured, you're injured. We get it, we get it. What about you? First of all, how far can you go? You also can't get everyone here. Your agility is not as fast as either of these people, so therefore we will go ahead and use you first. So why the heck not? I'm gonna get some healing in right now. Hope you don't mind. La 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 la. Everyone's gonna get some healing in right now. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fantastic. I just hope that we can end up getting this guy killed. Probably use Vlad, most likely. 
Not Nikola, though, because Nikola already moved a thing, right? Did I already move him? I think I did. Oh, man, I swear. 84 experience points, and he didn't level up. I mean, that's surprising, really. So I found the shenanigans with this here. I was like, what the heck is this? I realized off screen when an enemy was using God Bless on one single person, it's supposed to be a cross. That's literally all it's supposed to be. It's just one single pillar. It's a cross. That's all it is. The reason why there's multiple pillars is because it's striking multiple people. I didn't realize that. I was like, what the heck is going on here? I'm really confused. So yeah, I ended up answering that confusion just coincidentally. No, I'm just kidding. It wasn't coincidentally at all, but still. It was nice to at least get the question answered because I was like, I was really confused. I had no idea what was going on. I was like, mm, okay. This kind of looks like it should be judgment, but it's really not because of the random little horizontal lines just randomly show up for no reason. It kind of looks weird when you end up having multiple lines and just like, whoop, okay, there's multiple crosses. This looks like a jumbled mess. You don't even know what you're looking at. So obviously the first time I saw that, I was like, what am I looking at? I don't understand this. This makes no sense. Ah, good job taking that hit right there. I am indeed very, very proud of you. Okay. Well, I'm realizing I probably don't want to do that, actually. Ooh. Okay, yeah, that'll be fine, actually. So, Vlad... I would like you to go ahead and hit this guy, please. At least the very at least you won't get counterattacked. That's the important thing here. Okay, unnecessary critical hit, but I'll take it nonetheless. Oh shoot. 91 damage. Interesting. That was a lot of damage right there. I don't like it. I really don't like it, but what can you do about it? I'm just gonna say, where's he at? There's he at. There he's in. There's he at. Found Sims. Found some really goods. Okay, well, where can you strike? Can you strike me? No, you can't. All right, guilty. Make your move, good sir. Make your move and please get a crit. Pretty please. I would like a crit right now. Thank you very much. I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it so much. All right, time for some brawling, I suppose. I literally can't even get this guy anymore. Okay. Well, that's fine either way. Let's see. Brawler. Don't even think about blocking me. Don't even think about it, alright? Do I make myself clear? Good. Good. I'm glad I made myself very clear. Uh, I mean, uh, Falcon Punch! Oh, yeah! Oh, let's do this! All right, well, anyway, though, I think that is enough for today's episode. You know exactly what I'm going to be doing next. You know exactly what I'm going to be doing next. I'm basically just going to have her move on top of him, do a thing. Well, I mean, I'm probably going to make her go first because it makes more sense, but yeah. I'm just basically going to trust these people, make him brawl a few more times, that's going to be it. So yeah, I'll just end this episode right now. Let me know what you thought about that tavern fetch quest to get those two maps. It was kind of interesting, I'm not going to lie, but at the very least, we got them. We ended up getting them, so it's kind of nice, I suppose. I don't know. Let me know what you think about... This is Commandia, right? Let me know what you think about this Commandia map. It's pretty big, isn't it? It's also kind of inconvenient to the fact that I can't really fly on it very well. But, oh well, what can you do about it? I don't know. Wait a second, can she reach from that position? Yes, she can. Alright. Well, yeah. Next time, I'll have this map done already, and we'll be going on to the next map! Which one is it gonna be, though? You tell me. Well, actually, no, no, I'm gonna be recording this before that happens anyway. Well, let me know what you think I'm gonna do next. You think I'm gonna do Octopus next, or do you think I'm gonna do Gemini next? Let me know your thoughts on that, and maybe we'll see if you're right. <laughs> anyway, everyone, I will see you all later, so have a nice day. 
And don't forget to vote in the poll. It should be like right around over here somewhere. Or maybe even... I don't know. Maybe a few seconds before this. Or maybe... Well, I mean, it's in the description for sure. Anyway, just look for it there and vote. So good luck to your games, everyone. It'll end... Well, at the end of the series, of course. But I'll reveal the winner in a live stream like I normally do. So, yeah. Anyway, I'll see you later, everyone. Have a good day. Bye, 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 bye.